Hi guys, another one of my old projects that I found stored away up in the loft when I was getting our Christmas decorations down. This one's made from an old CD drive unit. Uh, it slides or opens and closes and then we've got a ratchet effect on the wheels so they can turn one way but not the other. Uh, it needs two 9 volt batteries, just hot glued here and here, a bit of soldering, if I can remember how it was wired up, and then we should be able to try it out again. I'll put the old video, or the original video, up in the top right here somewhere so you can actually watch the original video and there'll be a link so you can watch the original build. I'll just um, do a bit of gluing and soldering to get it back together. <laughs> well, there we go. Two 9 volt batteries glued in place. And then the negative from that one goes to one side of this changeover switch. And the positive of that one goes to the other side of it. And then the common point in the middle goes to the on-off switch. And then from the on-off switch goes to the motor. And then the other side of the motor comes through and connects to the negative of this battery, which is connected across to the positive of that battery. So what actually happens when you switch it on is it drives itself forwards and backwards. got there is the changeover switch is being pushed side to side by the movement of the tray. So we'll go and demonstrate that. I've got to say this is one of my all-time favorite builds this one. I just love the noise it makes. <clears throat> Back here, it's getting pointed straight. The only problem is, because I put the on-off switch on the bottom, it's difficult to get hold of. switch. There we go. And that's it. Oh, I love this one. 